Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hi, Marie. Hello, my lovely. Hi, Emma. Hi, Kerry and Charlotte. Hi, Samantha and Suzanne. Hi, Nat and Kaylee and Julie. Hello, hello, hello. How is everybody today? Oh, let me just refresh that because I didn't just do that. Okay, that's fine. Um, hi, Elaine. Hi, Sophie. Hi, Lillian. Hi, Lucy and Alison and Sue. Hello, hello, hello. How is everybody? Hi, Jutta. Hello. Hi, Tony. Nicola. Hello. Hi, Angela. And Hannah. Hello, hello, hello. Hi, Vicky. Jamie, I'm fine, thank you. How are you? Hi, Angela and Sandy. Hello, 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 hello. It's Tuesday. Oh, my oyster. I think that's okay, actually, for the oyster camera. Uh, Sue, bless you. 24 week streak. And Sue, thank you ever so much for sending stars there. Um, oh, Carrie, I hope you're all, all okay. Um, hi Suz Suzanne, hi Heidi and Jamie and Sam, hello. Uh, so today is a normal opening day. We've got the uh, bursting hearts available. January sale is still available and all oysters are available at the moment. Um, if you would like to order, you can be added on for today's order list and yeah, I posted an order list earlier, so hopefully if you have ordered already, you can see your name on that order list. There's nothing, um, there's some bits coming up this week, so keep an eye out on the page. And um, has anybody seen on the Pearls of Brecon stories, I messed one of them up, I got them <laughs> mixed up, uh, but I've started putting the scratch, uh, like 30 second, um, videos for different the different places we've scratched off so far uh, in our Pearls of Brecon stories. Has anybody started seeing those? If you would like to order, you can do so on our website. Thank you, Tara. It's www.pearlsofbrecon.com. Uh, if you place an order on the website, you'll then get added to today's order list, unless you request for a different day. That's fine as well. We've got mystery oysters, new new rainbow oysters, expand the rainbow oysters, normal oysters and Christmas oysters. So mystery is a mix of all the colours. Expand the rainbow is lighter rainbow colours. New new rainbow is darker rainbow colours, normal natural colours in the normals bag and then Christmas bag is Christmassy colours. Okay, um, apart from that, You've seen the videos, perfect. I mean, there's still more to go on, um, but I'm having a little bit of trouble with the video, with the stories. It's just my computer, because I upload from my computer, it just doesn't seem to get on. <laughs> just with that one feature on Facebook, the feature's not broken, because obviously it works for everybody. I think I just am having trouble with it. So yeah, bear with me, I'm just trying to um, get them on. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Right, so shall we get started for today? Um, up first today is a Mary Beth Lee Hirsch. Mary Beth, are you here? Sorry, just blown out the candle there. Angie, thank you ever so much for the stars there. If you heard that noise, yeah, I was just blown out the, out the candle. I think it's getting right to the end of the um of the wick. So yeah, I just didn't want to keep it burning while I'm not looking. Don't like while I don't have it in my eyesight. So 
So Mary Beth Lee Hirsch, are you here? Mary Beth, if you are here, please type I'm invisible. It will bring your comment forward so I can see you. Um, and if anybody can see Mary Beth, please comment on her comments because it will bring it forward so I can see. I've got the huge cup of tea again today. Okay, last call for Mary Beth. If not, we'll move on. Why is it freezing? I don't know why that would be freezing for people. Um, I mean, I'll have a quick look at the stream settings. How's my neck? I mean, it's still, oh, did you see that? It still twinges slightly, but I, I mean, I've got, I can look everywhere. It's just I can feel, feel that it twinges. Did you see that? <laughs> Just flinging my neck around there. Uh, let me have a quick look for this stream. All right, I haven't seen Mary Beth. Um, where's advanced settings? Uh, um, okay, so my end, it does look like it's um, okay. So hopefully, if it is a Facebook thing, it will sort itself out. Okay, so we're going to move on. So hopefully, if she comes on again, we can add her in, but it will be to the end of the order list there. Up next, then, I'm looking for today is Angela North. Angela, are you here? So people are saying it's good on their phones, not on their iPads. Maybe it's a Facebook thing that it's um, different coding or something they're working on. Obviously, I don't know, but it may be that. Angela, hello. Hello, hello, hello. So Angela, I hear that um, you may have a um, birthday coming up. So I hope you have a brilliant day on your birthday. Uh, and you've got this as a little gift for you. Now, I don't know if I can say what it is, so I'm not going to say just in case um, she would like it to be a surprise when you open it at home. However, I can say that you do have one oyster opening altogether. So, Angela, what type of oyster would you like? And would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? Uh, yep, yeah, if you order today, it will be open today. I'll do a, um updated order list as we go. I can, Sophie. Oh, bless you. Thank you. Okay, so Angela, Sophie has got you the Moon and Stars Cage Pendant. Moon and Stars Cage Pendant. So I hope you're happy with that. And it is on the website if you just wanted to have a little look at it as well. Because um, the image is on the website. And with it being a cage pendant, um, you can swap and change the pearls around that are inside the cage pendant there. So if you have any pearls at home or if you get any in the future, you'll be able to swap and change those around. Nicola, thank you ever so much for the stars there. Uh, keep the shells and you're looking for a white or a pinky colour um, so I would say there's a few different oysters to go for um, you can either go for the Christmas oyster which would have a white in it um, obviously if you get an oyster with the whites you a mystery oyster would have whites and pinks natural oysters would have whites and natural pinks 
Um, so if you wanted to go, I'd possibly suggest the mystery bag if that's um, okay with you. The website is in the description above. So if you go to the description above and click see more, it will drop down and the website is www.pearlsabrecken.com. Oh, Sophie says go for a natural one, Angela. What happened to the other? Uh, if something's not on the website, it may have been sold out. Um, so if something comes off of the website once it's fully sold out. Um, yeah. Natural one, Angela. Perfect. So you'd like to keep your shells. Now, oh, there we go. And you're hoping for a pinky colour or a white. So let me get this open for you. And let's go down. So in here, your natural coloured oyster. There's one side. And the other side. And in here, you have a rose gold and there's no more in that one. So you have a rose gold, my lovely Angela. Now, I'm just going to clean the shells up for you and then I'm going to hold this up so you can have a closer look and you can let me know what you think. Now, if you're happy with this one, that's perfect. If you're not happy, we can swap him for you. What do you think to this one? Let me pop him through, through the board for you. He's not a five, not a 5.5, .5, not a six. He is a 6.5. Now, Angela, if you're not happy with this one, we can swap him for you. If you are happy, then that's perfect. So it's completely up to you, my lovely. Yes, that looks fine. Perfect. So I'm glad you're happy with that one. Um, let me pop it in here safely for you. And I'm just going to wrap up your shells as well for you, my lovely. Okay, so Angela, again, I hope you have or have had a brilliant birthday. Um, and I hope you're happy with this gift once it arrives as well. Sophie, I hope you're happy with everything there as well, my lovely. So that's all safe up there for you, okay. Uh, that was the first one today. Right. Um, there was, yeah, we didn't have, we had a Marianne who I called out first, but she wasn't here um, just yet. Sophie and Angela, you're both very, very welcome. Right. Up next then today is Deborah Ingham. Deborah Ingham, are you here? Go 
lay down. Good boy, go lay down. I didn't realise I had him in here. Good boy. He does have a little bed over there. <laughs> he must have snuck in as I opened the door. Deb, Deborah, hello, hello, hello. Uh, the giraffe may come back in stock. Yes, just keep an eye on, on the website, Katie. Uh, so, Deborah, you are the first today with a bursting heart. He really is, Sue. And because he's so small, he doesn't make a sound. Literally, if I'm if I'm opening the door, especially if I've got a drink in my hand, it takes me I like to manoeuvre everything. Um, yeah, and he's snuck in before I know him. Because he's such a dark furred dog as well, if it's dark outside, I just don't see him. <laughs> right, so let's bring you over to this screen here. So you have a bursting heart, Deborah. I'll need to know which number heart you would like and then if you'd like to keep or if you'd like to donate your shells. So you can see here numbers one through to 12, which number heart would you like? Number 11 and donate the shells, perfect. So number 11 is this one here. If I just bring you back. Oh, I didn't get my, um, this down. I have, he's a toy poodle. Yeah, toy poodle. He's, he is, I, we're going to get, I have to get him a, I need to get another one. <laughs> it's my mission. I really, really want to get another dog for him to have a little friend. But yeah, at the moment, he's a toy poodle. Right, let's get this open, Deborah. Okay, so in here, you have a pendant. Oh, I love this one. Okay, so I just need to double check the website before I say um, if this one's... I just need to double check that what this one has. Uh, you'll see what I mean in a moment. Um... Just because before I show you, I don't want to get it wrong. Keeping you in, su in suspense here, my lovely. Okay, having a quick look. Da, da, da. It doesn't help that I don't know the name of this one off the top of my head either. Um, so I'm just having to quickly. No, it's not that one. Basically, I think but one of my pendants is 925 silver um, and it's actually got gold, a gold overlay. And then one of them is 925 silver, but has a... Um, just the colour gold overlay on sections of it. So I just want to confirm with this one before I say if it is gold or not. Oh, I can't find it. Let me show you it. Let me show, because I don't, I'm, yeah. So it's, I don't know if this is the one with the gold or if it's the golden overlay. So as you can see, the stalk of the tree is 95 silver and then the love hearts you can see are the golden color there now i will be able to let you know once i locate it deborah if they are 95 silver with the golden overlay or if they are the nine carat gold hearts there um i just can't remember off the top of my head and i'm ever so sorry for that either way though i hope you're happy with this one now with this one you can have the pearl either at the top of the pendant here or you don't have to have the pearl on here at all if you don't want to um so you can have the pendant as it is and then the pearl loose so that's going to be completely after uh, up to you debs 
okay so the oh the reverse side as well uh is just the outline so it is just the golden which makes me think it may just be the golden coating of the color on top i'll double check for you though i'll look into it i'll find it <laughs> Is that what it says, Amy? What, what's the item called? Is that what it says on the website, my lovely? I just didn't want to say it was gold gold without um, obviously confirming. But Debs, I hope you're happy with that one. Let me bring you back up here. Kelly, thank you ever so much for the stars there. Now, I'm just going <laughs> to pop you on this screen while I grab leaves of love let's have a quick look <sighs> leaves of love ah yep yeah, there it is so i've got your oyster bag deb's leaves of love pendant it 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 has the hearts are plated with my, one micron of 18 karat yellow gold. Okay, so it is gold gold, not the um, colouring of gold. Okay, so Kelly Bruce, bless you. Thank you ever so much for the stars there. That's very, very kind of you. Debs, let's dive in for your oyster. So you'd like to donate your shells. Oh, is there a certain colour you're hoping for? Um, and are you thinking pearl on or pearl off of the jewellery here? Okay, so let's go down. There's one side and the other side. And in here you have a autumn peach, pearl on. Okay, so you have an autumn peach there. Just confirm for me, Debs, now you've seen the colour, are you still happy with this pearl on the jewellery there? Let me dry him up for you. And here he is in the sand. If I run him through the board for you as well, he's not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, he is a 7. Yes, that's fine. Perfect, Debs. Okay, so if I bring you back up, I'm sorry um, for the wait there, my lovely, but I do hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives. That's on there for you. And thank you ever so much for the donations of your shells as well. And that's safe up there for you. Yeah, can you just take him with you? I think he needs to go into the garden though, Bab, if you pop him down. Is that all right? Thank you. Sorry, I think Kovi was um, walking around and when he does that, he normally needs to go into the garden. So I just asked Aaron to come and grab him. Oh, wow, Chloe. Oh, bless you, Nikki. <laughs> right, different kitchen towel, just because I ran out of my normal stuff, which is arriving tomorrow. So I had to quickly nip out to grab this and it's a lot thinner than what I normally use so we'll see how absorbent it is um it might get soaked but we'll see what happens right uh donated shells so donated shells if I show you here my mum works in a nursery these are just two different examples of what the shells are used for in different collages play learning about the world um just some creativity with the children
Okay, up next then today is Sandra Waite. Sandra, are you here? I'm just printing this off here. Sandy, hello, and thank you for confirming with the email address there. Uh, so, Sandy, oh, let me update the heart here. You've got two bursting hearts. There we go. So, if I take you across to the bursting heart screen, uh, what two numbers would you like? And would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? Uh, thank you, Andrea, for the stars there, my lovely. Thank you ever so much. Uh, number three and number nine. Uh, so number three is this one. And number nine is this one. So let's bring you back. And we're gonna go straight down. This one here is number three. This one is number nine. So we'll open up number three first. Okay, so in your first heart, you have a bracelet here. So the bracelet, again, the name eludes me and I'm ever so sorry for that. Now, I think it might be the Shannon bracelet, but if I'm wrong, I do apologize. Let me show you the links here. Just gonna get it to focus. Why doesn't it want to focus today? Oh, so this bracelet is 925 silver. It comes with one oyster opening and it is 7.5 inches long. It can be add an, an extension chain can be added onto it if, if it need be. I'm so sorry, I can't seem to get it. Oh, slowly does it. Ha ha! Okay, so you can see that the bigger links are like a twisted um, silver and then it has these kiss links which are keeping the bigger ones together. Now you can put pearls on the bigger links uh, and they do fit lobster fittings as well. Okay, so that's your bracelet there from number three. And then moving on to heart number nine. Yes, that bracelet is on the website. Lucy, bless you. Thank you ever so much for the stars there. Okay, so in here, you have a cage pendant and there's nothing else in there. So with your cage pendant, this also comes with one oyster opening. Um, and as you know, with cage pendants, if you have any pearls at home, you can swap and change the pearls around in that cage pendant. It is the Shannon bracelet. Bless you, Carol. Thank you. Okay, so this is the petals cage pendant here. So you can see that your pearl is going to be sat right in the centre there. And then you've got these petals coming off around the edge, almost like a sunflower, but I'm not 
fully convinced it is the sunflower. On the reverse side, you can have it this way around because the bale in the, in the, um, the section in the centre does have the cutouts to see the pearl and then the petals would be at the back of the flower there. So this would be the front, but you could wear it either way around if you wanted to. Okay, so I hope you're happy with that one as well, Sandy. So they each come with one oyster opening. If I bring you back up again. So let's dive in here, donating the shells. Sandy, is there certain colours that you're hoping for? One and two. And with the bracelet, you can have your pearl on the bracelet or you don't have to, you can have the bracelet as it is if you prefer to. So just let me know either way there. So let's go back down. Uh, Emma, I believe it would be in the Valentine's Day section if it's still in stock, my lovely. So Sandy, oyster number one. There's one side and the other side. And in your first oyster, you have a coral pearl. And there's no more in that one. So oyster number one has given you a coral. Let me dry him up for you. And then moving on to oyster number two. There's one side and the other side. And in here you are quadding. You are quadding, my lovely. So you've got the four pearls in the one oyster there. Quite an unusual quadding set there as well, actually. And there's no more in that one. So let me just dry these up for you. Shereya, thank you ever so much for the stars there. Shereya, I think, hopefully I pronounced your name correctly, my lovely. Sandy, you have... Where's my pearl picker? You've got a beautiful bright icy blue, a apple green, a bright watermelon, and an oil slick pearl as well. Let me just show you this oil slick. Oh, are we gonna see it? So you can see, you can see purple, blue, and green as the pearl goes around. It's harder to see on the camera, but that's definitely an oil slick. I hope you can see that there. So all together, your top row, you have your coral. And then from your quadding oyster, you've got an icy blue, an apple green, a watermelon, and an oil slick pearl. Sandy, I hope you're happy with those. Um, now, would you like a pearl on the bracelet? And if so, which one would you like? Your coral is not a five, not a 5.5. .5 not a six he's a 6.5 icy blues not a five not a 5.5 .5, not a six he's a 6.5 the greens not a five not a 5.5 .5, not a six not a 6.5 he's a seven the watermelons not a five not a 5.5 .5, not a six he's a 6.5 and the oil slicks not a five not a 5.5 .5, not a six not a 6.5 he is a seven What do you think to those? Oil slick independent coral on the bracelet, perfect. And lobster fitting on the others. Let me write this down. So we're going to have, okay, so on the pendant oil slick, 
Uh, we're going to have coral on the bracelet and then perfect I've got that down for you uh, the invoice for the lobster fittings will get sent across for you tomorrow and that will go to the email address that's on the order form okay so let me just pop all of your pearls in here for you perfect sandy thank you ever so much for the donations with your shells and i hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives and that's safe up there for you no you're very very welcome my lovely uh, and up next then today is kerry low kerry are you here Kerry, hello, hello, hello. And you're there with Hayden as well. Hello, my lovely. Uh, so you have a bursting heart today. Let's go back across to the bursting hearts um, screen. I did just top all the hearts up again. So you get to pick which bursting heart you would like and if you'd like to keep or if you'd like to donate your shells. Oh, number 12. That's this one here. And donate the shells, perfect. So let's get him open. And then let's go down. In here, it looks like you have a pair of earrings. It is a pair of earrings. Oh, I love these ones. There isn't a bonus. We don't think we've had a bonus yet today. There isn't a bonus in this one. Now, these earrings are harder to show you. Um, now, they are hoop earrings. Okay. Now, they're called the sparkle hoop earrings. Is there too much going on? Well, let me grab a plane. Um. Okay, so the section at the top is obviously the bit that goes in the air. Now this section at the front is all encrusted with zircon crystals and your pearls are going to be set at the bottom there where you can see the pin at the bottom. So your pearls sit at the bottom of the hoop. The back of the hoop, I don't know if I can show you, oh, is the plain silver. So sparkle at the front, silver at the back and then your pearls at the bottom there. I hope you're happy with those my lovely. So let me just pop those back in there for you so that actually comes with two oyster openings uh, so you're donating the shells would there be certain colors that you're hoping for with these and with because you do have earrings if you prefer to have even colors um, you can swap if I mean if you don't get evens or if you're not happy with the colors that you got in your opening here you can swap one to match another from your opening okay so i hope you're happy with all of those let's go down would there be certain colors that you guys are hoping for oyster number one There's one side and the other side. And in here, you are quadding. You have got four pearls in your first oyster there. You are quadding, my lovely. Now, let me just dry these up for you. Okay. 
we have got a lemon yellow, a bright icy blue, a coral and a dark grape purple to start with there. So lemon yellow, bright icy blue, coral and dark purple. Then moving on to your next oyster. Can't see the earrings on the website. Ah, they may not be on there just yet. There's one side and the other side. And in here you are twinning. And you're twinning with two tonal icy blue pearls. And there's no more in that one. So let me just dry these up for you and I'll hold them up so you can have a closer look as well. Okay, so the brighter of the two is more two-tonal. So you can see here, he's more lighter and darker. And then the overall lighter one does have a few darker uh, marks, but overall is just the lighter of the two pearls. Kerry, what do you think to these, my lovely? Now, like I said, if you would prefer to swap one to match another, we can do that for you. Um, or if you're happy with these, just let me know which two you'd like on the jewellery. Let me run them through the board. So your lemon yellow is not a 5, not a 5.5, .5, not a 6. He's a 6.5. Bright icy blue is not a 5, not a 5.5, .5, not a 6. He's a 6.5. The coral's not a 5, not a 5.5, .5, not a 6, he's a 6.5. And the purple's not a 5, not a 5.5, .5, not a 6, he's a 6.5. The lighter icy blue's not a 5, not a 5.5, .5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, he's a 7.5. And the brighter of the two's not a 5, not a 5.5, .5, not a 6, not a 6.5, .5, not a 7, he's a 7.5 as well. Swap the coral to match the yellow and have the yellows on there, of course you can. Uh, there's not gonna be a weight or anything. Let me just have a little look. There we go. Oh, where's my... I'm just going to put that back there. I don't know where I put my colour swap pot. Okay, so just confirm, are you happy with those yellows there? Rachel, bless you. Thank you ever so much for the stars there. Okay, so let me bring you back up again. Pop these in here. Yes, perfect. Okay, so Kerry, I hope then you're happy with everything once it arrives. And Hayden, I hope you're happy as well, my lovely. Uh, thank you both for the donations with the shells. That's on there, and then that's all safe up there for you. Perfect. Just give me one second. Oh, Marie, bless you. Thank you ever so much for the stars there. 42-week streak. Thank you, my lovely. 
Um, up next today is Martina. What well, I can't get this off. <laughs> Martina Story. Are you here? Becky, thank you, my lovely. Um, join the Squidgy Pops group as well. It's only for the supporters. Martina, hello. Um, so, Martina, you have a natural oyster and a picky pearl. So, if we do your natural oyster first, um, would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells here? Let's get him open and let's go down. Donate, okay, is there a certain colour you're hoping for? So in here. There's one side and the other side. Oh, um, now these are not normal natural coloured pearls. <laughs> this happened before, didn't it? These have um, these are not normal natural coloured pearls. These, I would guess, are expand the rainbow colours. Now, let me dry them up for you here. Now, if you're happy with these, then that's perfect. If you're not happy, I can swap them for you. I'm ever so sorry that they're not the natural colour there, but you've got a lighter purple and then a slightly darker purple as well. They are beautiful. But like I said, if you're not happy, we can swap them. So lighter purple and darker purple. And if you are happy with these, um, You'll need, if you can let me know which one you'd like on the fitting there. So the lighter of the two is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5. And the darker of the two is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5. what do you think to those they're lush so are you happy with those if so which one would you like on the fitting the darker one perfect you also have a picky pearl bag as well so let me just write this down so with the picky pearl bag I'm going to dive in, give them a little mix and I'm going to pick a bag out. I mean I've picked a whole chunk of bags out, let me just narrow this, oh, narrow this down. They went everywhere didn't they? Okay, so you have this bag here. So what I'm going to do, you've got three pearls in this bag. I'm going to put all three in the sand, Martina, and then you get to pick which two pearls you would like to keep. The third pearl gets popped back in the swaps pot. Okay, so let's go down. You've got a bright, hot pink. What did I say, Kirsty? 
bright hot pink, dark olive green and a TARDIS blue. Which two of these would you like to keep? The middle and the blue so I'll take the pink away and then we can measure these two so the dark olive greens not a five not a 5.5 not a six not a 6.5 he's a seven and the blues not a five not a 5.5 not a six not a 6.5 he's a seven as well Martina my lovely I hope you're happy with that then uh, and I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives if I pop these on here Thank you for the donations with your shells as well. And that's safe up there for you. I'm not sure what you mean, Lexi. Um, right, up next is Linda Southam. Linda, are you here? Linda, hello, hello, hello. I've never done this before. Oh, bless you, Martina. Well, I do hope you're happy. And Linda, my lovely, hello. You have one opening altogether. What type of oyster would you like? And would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? natural and donate the shells perfect so is there a certain color you're hoping for linda let me get this open and let's go down okay so in here there's one side and the other side and in here you have a bridal white and there's no more in that one What do you think to a bridal white, my lovely? Now again, Linda, if you're happy with this, that's perfect. And if you're not, we can swap him for you. Uh, Jane, if you would like to order, you can do so on our website. You'll find the link in the above, above comments. It's www.pearlsabrecken.com. Linda, it's perfect. He's not a five, not a 5.5, .5, not a six. He is a 6.5. Linda then I'm glad you're happy with that one I'll pop him on the jewelry here so let me pop this on here uh, thank you as well for the donations of your shells my lovely and that's safe up there for you
No, Linda, you're very, very welcome. Okay, so I'm just printing this off and then I can call out the next person. Let me just top up the hearts while I'm there. There we go. Okay, so up next today is Kirsty Davidson. Kirsty Davidson, are you here? You, Jane yep if you order today it will be open today um, if you would like it to be open today so if you order today on the website uh, I'll print it off and we'll just call you as we go Kirsty hello uh, Kirsty you have two bursting hearts here so what two heart numbers would you like and would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells Rowena, it's going really well, thank you. I am putting little snippets on our um, story on Facebook and Instagram with how it's going. Um, I haven't obviously uploaded all the locations yet, but I will do. Oh, Valia, bless her. I hope she feels better soon. Oh, gosh. Valley is first. She'd like number four and donate the shells. Okay. Oh, that one didn't want to come off there then. So number four, let me bring you back again. And let's open him up. Yes. So the maps behind me are scratch off maps. And at the start of January, um, I started scratching off the places where which have ordered. So the locations of orders obviously it's in counties and countries and stuff so it's not exact locations at all so yeah just to see where i've posted around the globe which is quite cool so let's go down okay so in number four number four you have a bonus there's nothing in the heart here you have a bonus. Now, this is the first bonus of the night. Uh, so, with the bonus, Kirsty, um, she gets to pick a 925 silver stud pair of earrings. Now, they've got 8 mil crystal pearls on them. You get to pick which colour pearl you would like. So, there's cream, Mary, uh, mulberry pink, green, and Tahitian look, which is a silver with a green overtone. So cream, mulberry pink, green or Tahitian. Which one would you like? Whoop, whoop. The dark ones, the Tahitian ones, okie dokie. So that's these ones here. They are yours. Uh, so the item which Valia has is a pendant. I'm just going to take the bonus bit away there. So she has a pendant. Um, I think on the website this is called, I think it's called the pathway pendant. If I'm wrong, I do apologise. Now, oh, let's make it a little bit lower. 
you can see up here is a butterfly with encrusted wings. Now it's the pathway pendant because it's the pathway, the loop-de-loop -loop, and then up here that the butterfly has flown. Now your pearl is going to be set right in the centre of that circle pinned area there. You've got the zircon crystals here and of course in the wings of the butterfly. So I hope you're both happy with that one. And that comes with one opening and I will need to know what uh, pearl goes on there. Okay, so if I bring you back up, what we'll do, Kirsty, is we'll grab your number 10 as well. But then when we open up the oysters, of course, we'll open up Valiers first and we'll go that way. So your number 10, it was number, can you just confirm, was it number 10 here? So I'm going to bring you back. I won't open it until you let me know if that's... Um, I thought I saw 10. <laughs> yes, okay, so let's get him open. And let's go back down. So in here, you have a pendant as well. Now your pendant, it doesn't have to have the um, pearl on there if you don't want to. And it is, it is also butterfly themed. There we go. So this butterfly has got mother of pearl in its wings here. So as you can see, the mother of pearl does reflect different colors uh, just as it catches the light. And it's got this dotted design on the edges of the wings there as well. Now, if you would like to have your pearl on here, it will be sat at the top there, I'll be able to move around. Or you don't have to have the pearl on the jewelry. You can have the pendant as it is and the pearl loose. Kirsty, I hope you're happy with that one. Okay, so you've got two oyster openings, one for Valia, one for you. Um, where's the bag? This one here. Are there certain colours that you're hoping for? So this one is Valia's, Kirsty. This one is yours. I'm going to open them both up, but the bigger one will be going first. I hope I'm pronouncing um, names correctly. If I'm not, please correct me. I do apologise. Right, let's go down. So Valia's oyster first here, donating the shells. There's one side and the other side. And in here you are twinning. And twinning with darker, I think they're chocolate twins here. Oh. They are beautiful, darker chocolate twins there. Ve Vela, but we're well used. Oh no, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry to both of you. Please, honestly, correct me and shout at me if I get if I pronounce names wrong, because um, it's the only way I'm going to learn. Otherwise, of course, I'm just going to keep calling you by the wrong name this whole time. Vela, and that's a beautiful name as well, so it needs to be said correctly. So thank you. I hope I'm saying it right now. Um, Kirsty, moving on to your oyster. There's one side. And the other side. Oh, and you've got one pop out backwards 
and two, you are also twinning. And there's no more in that one. Now you're twinning with blush pinks. It does look like one pearl is slightly darker than the other one here. Okay, so what do you think to these? I'll need to know which one is on Vela's pendant and which one is on your pendant, if you'd like one on there, Kirsty. So chocolate twins and a lighter pink and a darker pink. What do you think to those? If we run them through the board, chocolate number one is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven, not a 7.5, he's an eight. Chocolate number two is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven, not a 7.5, he's an eight. The slightly lighter pink is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, he's a seven. And the slightly darker of the two is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, he's a seven as well. Yep, the pinks can go on there, that's not a problem. Uh, do you have a preference as uh, which one, who has the lighter pink and who has the darker pink? Or don't you mind? Thank you, Bab. Can I have the, um, if it's time? Yes. I did, thank you, Charlie. I hope you did as well her the lighter of the two and you the darker one yep that's done I'll write it down as well Kirsty not a problem at all so I hope you both two seconds please I hope you both are happy with everything once it arrives was you gonna interrupt me mid-sentence Deary me, I hope you're both <laughs> happy with everything once it arrives. Uh, Vela, again, I, I hope you feel better soon um, with your broken leg there. And yeah, thank you for the donations of your shells. And that's safe up there for you. Please excuse me one moment. I'm just going to pop you on bursting hearts, if that's okay. I'll refill them in just a second. Thank you. Uh, he prefers to be booked in, Samantha. He's one of, he's like, <laughs> no, but he prefers now to have, um, to have notice and to be booked in. Um, mainly because, for example, he's got in from work, he's had a shower and he's just put, um, like lazy housewear on, which he wouldn't want to come on camera in, which is very understandable. Um, so it, by giving him a little bit, even if it's just for the next live, that little bit of notice, he knows that obviously to get dressed properly. I mean, he's dressed, but you know what I mean? Um, and just to give him a moment. So yeah, he does like to be booked in. He doesn't like me springing up on him anymore, which I do understand, I do. Yes, I have a tea, he brought me a tea, just to get him drunk again. <laughs> I mean, yeah, <laughs> he won't be opposed to that. He, although he doesn't drink in the week so because of work. So yeah, Friday lives, or if we do a bonus on a Saturday, is the only days you're going you're gonna to catch him. Um, yeah, because he doesn't obviously drink in the week because of work. He's up early, bless him. Yeah, bless him. Uh, he doesn't like coming on in his Harry Potter PJs. He doesn't like coming on. I'm in his Harry Potter PJs. He doesn't have Harry Potter PJs, although I'm sure he would wear them if he had them. <laughs> yeah, comfy loungewear, it is the one, but I do understand, like if you do, some of my comfy stuff, I wouldn't come on the live in, just cause it is, yeah, it's just not, it's just for my household to see. It's just one of those things. He is, he is good fun, he, I, I all agree. I don't do Harry Potter either. <laughs> I have some Harry Potter PJs. Uh, I've worn them once. I didn't, I wasn't very comfortable. 
but I've kept them because I love opening the drawer to see them there. It is Samantha, I do agree. Uh, right, he does need some cursed here. I'll grab him some. Um, he meant to be the last. <laughs> he said to me, Victoria, he can't do that again. <laughs> <laughs> like he, he yeah he was mortified of what happened before bless him absolutely mortified right up next today is samantha bodell samantha are you here you have kia See mine, yeah, mine are head headwing. Um, I think the issue with mine is is just I'm not used. They're they're very short shorts, um, and me personally, as a larger lady, I don't often wear short shorts. Never in public. This is just my own personal preference. I'm not against them. I'm just not very comfortable. Um, so and then wearing them to bed, I just wasn't comfortable. <laughs> So I've kept them. I wear the top, just not the the shorts. Yeah. It's one of those things. Samantha, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Oh, no, Larissa, I've got an Eeyore pyjamas as well. I love Eeyore. I've got all the uh, pyjamas. I love pyjamas. I like mugs. I collect them. <laughs> Right, um, Samantha, my lovely. Oh, you have three bursting hearts. So let's go across to the bursting heart wall. Uh, so which three numbers would you like? Uh, and would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? Aaron actually went out in his Claire is the Udi the big massive like um f not fairy but the fluffy massive oversized jumper one um I got him one for Christmas and he took the kids to their swimming lesson in it the other day I was like you're not going to wear that out of the house he's like but I'm comfortable <laughs> mm. Yeah, the huge jumper. Yeah, he wears his out to the shops and everything. It's a big Marvel one. <laughs> right. Oh, Samantha, two, eight and nine. So number two is that one. Number eight is that one. And number nine is this one. So I'm just going to bring you back. And then I've put them down so we can open them down here. So it's gone two, eight, nine. I did them in number order. Two, eight, and nine. Okay, so I'm just going to move these back. Inside number two. They're not for everyone, Stella Marie. Okay, so, ooh. Inside number two, you have a bonus. So with your bonus, you get to pick which pair of earrings you would like. So again, they're 925 silver stud back earrings. You get to pick which color crystal pearl you would have. So they are eight mil crystal pearls, cream mulberry pink, green or tahitian which is like a dark silver with a green overtone so you can just say um silver with that one if you'd prefer so cream mulberry pink green or tahitian what would you like bonus
the pinky colour, perfect. So, oh, they are yours, pre-made. Uh, let me pop that on there. So let's have a look at in here. You have a pendant there. Oh, I love this one. Now this one is on the website. It's called, oh, I think it's called the Rainbow of Hearts Pendant. Now, as you can see here, it looks like a rainbow and your pearl is gonna get set right in the center there. So it's in the center of the rainbow. However, if we turn it to its side, it, the, to make up the rainbow are lots of little hearts and even the bale is made up of hearts. Oh, it's so hard to show you. So it's a heart rainbow and the bale, like I said, this is all made up of hearts as well. So hearts everywhere. So your pearl gets set in the centre of the rainbow of hearts. I hope you're happy with that one. So that comes with one opening and I will need to know what uh, pearl colour you'd like on there. If we open up number eight. Okay, so this is your number eight. Nothing in there. And in here, you have another pendant. So in here, your pendant, um, I th again, I think this is the cradle pendant. I'd have to double check. Now this one is lovely. It comes down in a single little um, curvy line and then it comes and cradles round and then goes back into the silver and it's encrusted with zircon crystals. Your pearl is gonna be set in the center of the raindrop cradle there. So again, this one does need to um, have the pearl color and have the pearl, sorry, it does need to have the pearl on the jewelry. So I will need to know the pearl color at the end there. Okay, so two pendants so far. And then moving on to, this was number nine. Okay, so in here, you have another bonus, my lovely. Bonus. You have another bonus. So you get to pick another pair of earrings. Now you can have the same color if you wanted to. Um, if you wanted to just have two of the same color, if you wanted to gift it or anything like that. Or you can pick a different color of earrings as well. So cream, mulberry, pink, green, and Tahitian. Which color would you like? So second bonus. Which color would you like? The cream ones, perfect, and that's these ones here. So pink and cream earrings. And you have a cage pendant here. So three pendants, Samantha. This now, I'm just taking the bonus section away. Uh, so th three pendants, one is a cage pendant. So with the cage pendant, you can swap and change the pearls around in this at home. So um, if you've got any pearls at home or if you get any loose ones in the future, you can change the look of this pendant by changing the pearl. Now this one is called the Sparkling Heart Cage Pendant. Now you can see that the pearl sits in the center of the cage there and then down the one side, you've got zircon crystals sort of spiking out of the cage. Like I say, it's called the Sparkling Heart Cage Pendant. I hope you're happy with that one as well. 
Okay, so that goes in there. So each of those, Samantha, let me bring you back up, come with a oyster each. So three oysters all together. You'd like to donate your shells. Uh, is there certain colours that you're hoping for? One, two, and three. So let's get these open. One. Two. No, we have a stinker. I don't want to... I don't know if you can see. We're going to have to get a different one. Can you see the... Uh, it's gone cloudy and the, all the whiteness in there. That just means that it, it's a high potential for a stinker. And also it's not fully um, vacuumed either, which is also another sign. So I am going to have to pick another oyster there. I hope that's okay. Let's so say this one here. We'll open that one there first. Okay, so the one I just pulled out, the replacement, if you like, will open him up first. It looks a little gross. It does, they are, they can be. The stinkers can be quite not pleasant. Um, but yeah, I don't open them on the live anymore just because I open them in an open space because it's too, too tight of an office space and too cold outside to have to then leave the doors and windows open for an hour. Right, let's get this open. So there's one side. This was the replacement oyster. And the other side. And in here, you are twinning. And you're twinning with Blurple twins here. Now, Blurple is a mix between a blue and a purple. So if I dry this up, so a mix between a blue and a purple, I'm going to say that these ones look more purple, but um, you can see one slightly lighter, one slightly darker there. Moving on to oyster number two. There's one side and the other side. And in here, you are twinning for a second time. And there's no more in that one. Uh, when I've opened stinkers in the past, it smells like a, like a, a burst drain. Do you know when I don't know if anyone has ever smelt a burst drain. Um, like when you've got a really clogged drain pipe or it's or they're doing like it smells like that kind of thing. It's not pleasant. <laughs> now your twins here, Samantha, are twinning chocolate twins. Again, you've got a lighter and a slightly darker chocolate there. Chocolate there, sorry. Yeah, sewage kind of thing. It's not nice. <laughs> <laughs> Samantha moving on to your last oyster of course the normal oysters don't smell like that but yeah it's just the, the, the stinkers they just can real pack a punch <laughs> right there's one side and the other side and in here Samantha you are twinning for a third time there and there's no more in that one so three sets of twins my lovely you're twinning here with darker purple twins uh, one smaller than the other and the smaller one is like a brighter purple the large one's like a silvery purple okay so you can see here Oh, bless you, Stella. From Edison's, really, that surprises me, but bless you. Okay, so you've got a lighter and a darker blurple, a lighter and a darker chocolate, and a lighter and a darker purple. 
Now, if you're happy with these, I'll need to know which ones you'd like on which pendant. So you've got the rainbow of hearts, you've got the cradle, and then of course with your cage pendant, you're gonna be able to swap and change the pearls around um, at home. So darker blurple is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven, not a 7.5, not an eight. He's an 8.5. The lighter purple is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven, not a 7.5, not an eight. He's an 8.5. The lighter chocolate is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven. He's a 7.5. Darker chocolate is not a five, not a 5.5, not a six, not a 6.5, not a seven, not a 7.5. He's an eight. So they're measuring at different sizes there. The brighter purple is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5. He's an 8. And then the slightly darker purple is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7, not a 7.5, not an 8. He's an 8.5 as well. Which pearl would you like on which pendant, my lovely? So the heart, the rainbow of hearts and the cradle pendant. Sorry, if you can see flashes, I'll just come on to print um, the next order just because my comments are slightly delayed. Um, so it just takes a second to do that. Oh, Blurple in the cage, you don't mind which one. The chocolate on the second pendant, don't mind which one. So the chocolate on the cradle pendant and the lighter of the two purples on the rainbow. Perfect. That leaves you with these three here. So if I bring you back up, I'm going to write that down as well, but I've popped each one in, in the bag, each with the pendant, so I don't get it wrong. But if I write it down, it's like a double, double backup. So we've got the um, sparkle hearts cage we've got blurple the rainbow of hearts we've got the brighter purple and the cradle I th I'm going to put cradle I think it is we've got I've put the brighter chocolate on there Samantha, I hope you're happy with all of those, my lovely. Let me just pop these on here as well. Perfect. Um, thank you ever so much for the donations with your shells. And I hope you'll be happy with everything once it arrives. And that's safe up there for you. No, you're very, very welcome, Samantha. I'm glad you're happy with those. Okay. Uh, and up next then today is Sarah McIntosh. Sarah, are you here? So just restocking the uh, board there. Sarah, hello, my lovely. So you also have a bursting heart. Let's go across to the board. Uh, you get to pick numbers one through to 12. Which number heart would you like? And then, of course, would you like to keep or would you like to donate your shells? Are you guys hearing an echo? There you go, I've just turned the other microphone off. If you was hearing an echo that whole time, <laughs> is that any better? Gosh, if you have been, I'm so sorry. 
I've only just noticed. Seven and donate the shell. So seven's this one over here. Oh, okay, Bronnie. That's fine if there's no echo. Is it on this screen as well? It's okay. Right. If it hasn't been echoing, then that's brilliant. I've just turned the, the second one off, though. It's been... <laughs> Deary me. Right, okay, so your bursting heart, let's go down. This is number seven, Sarah, and you'd like to donate your shells. You have a cage pendant as well. This is a lovely cage pendant. Sound was perfect. I mean, I can turn it back on again. There you go, I turned it back on. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why both of them are on, but if it's okay, it's okay. Now, I'm just popping this on here. Now, this cage pendant is a newer cage pendant, and it's a little bit different. Okay. So it is the Moon's Gift Cage Pendant. Now, as you can see here, if I can get it focused, you've got this filigree designed moon and then you've got the gift it is holding. Now, it is all 925 silver. OK, but this one is coated with a golden colouring. OK, so that's not gold. It's coated with the gold colouring, but it is a 95 silver um, underneath and everything as well. So the filigreed moon and your pearl goes in this section here, which is a cage. So again, you will be able to change the pearl around inside this one, Sarah. So uh, I hope you're happy with this one. And as you can see, it does, it does like move and dangle and um yeah so that's called the moon's gift cage pendant if i bring you back up again and that comes with one opening as well so if i grab the bag for you is there a certain color that you're hoping for sarah let's get him open and let's go down so in here There's one side and the other side. And in here, it is a twinning night. You are twinning, my lovely. And there's no more in that one. So twinning with darker twins here. Let me just have a closer look to see what colours they are. That one is an oil slick and a chocolate. You have a darker chocolate, Sarah, and you have a oil slick as well. So a chocolate and a oil slick. Now, I don't know if you're going to be able to see green, blue, purple, and he's almost got that mottled silver overtone as well. Sarah, I hope you're happy with these. Oil slick and a chocolate there. So your oil slick is not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5. The chocolate's not a 5, not a 5.5, not a 6, not a 6.5, not a 7. He's a 7.5 as well. What do you think? Oh, 
I hope you're happy with those, my lovely. Let me bring you back up. Pop those in there. And then on here as well. No, Sarah, you're very, very welcome. Okay, so that's safe up there for you, Sarah. And thank you ever so much for the donations of your shells. Uh, and I hope you'll be happy with everything once they arrive as well. I've just refreshed the website. I believe that might be the end of the order list for today. How long has the live been? Oh, no, it's not, it's not too... I thought it was shorter than that, so that's fine. Um, oil slicks are rare, yes. Uh, so, we're going to be ending the live there today. I've just got shivers. I've got um, goosebumps. We're going to be live again on Friday evening. So, if you'd like to join us on Friday, or if you'd like to order, it can be opened on Friday evening. We'll be live around 8pm on Friday. Uh, so, I hope you'll have a brilliant week. And I'll see you then. Take care. Bye.